Tantra Online 2022 High Saviors GH here. Today we're gonna do a Tantra Online gameplay from the beginning to show you guys what it's like playing the game from the start. Tantra Online is an oriental fantasy MMORPG. And with that said, let's do this. Let's go play the game. Okay guys, here's the character creation and here are the different tribes. Here's the Naga, here's the Asura, the Yaksa, the Deva, Kimnara, Rakasa, Gandharva, Garuda, and we're back at Naga. What are we gonna play? We're gonna play as this Deva because I wanna try the magical characters. Because according to this, Deva tribe has less physical ability than the others but has the strongest magical powers. Okay, let's input our character name. Hey, wait a minute. Okay, there it goes. There's no insertion point. And chakra. I think we should increase mental. Max it out. Okay. And there it goes. There's no character customization. You just create a character, select a tribe, and that's it. Let's go play the game. How do we enter the game here? Just double click this character. Okay, there it goes. Okay. And we're in the game. What's happening? Why is my cursor stuttering when i'm moving the camera no matter the game works fine what are we supposed to do now welcome jh of the deva clan learn character movement try moving your character okay there it goes we're gonna do the tutorial the first time i played this i didn't do it because it's different it's not like this this is from a different server i guess they made it much more easier for newer players okay now learn how to change my view learn how to use my minimap m I am pressing M, bruh. What's happening, bruh? I am pressing M. Okay, what's happening here? I am pressing M. Look at this. It's even typing in here. Let's enter that. M. <laughs> it says press the M button to change the size of the minimap. Okay, I think I should turn off the audio first. Okay, I turned off the audio and I click this icon over here. And for some reason, the minimap tutorial is gone. Okay, anyway, learn shortcut key explanation. Press I to open the inventory. <laughs> What's happening? I'm pressing I. Ah, what's wrong with this game? It's telling me to press I. I'm pressing I and it's typing I over here. I think I need to change this to stop it. Oh, okay, I don't know. For some reason, I clicked something here and now I can open up my inventory and also my minimap. What's happening? Now it, the minimap is not working. <laughs> Okay, anyway, use my weapon. Use this weapon. We got the weapon. Can we move this thing because it's blocking our vision? Now learn hunting monsters. All right, let's hunt some monsters. Hunt one Basabum. I think it's outside. We're gonna hunt that one, whatever that is. Do you have a skill? No, I, what's this? I think this is attack. And this one is. What happened? I used this and some kind of a buff happened. Okay, anyway, attack this. Oof. Boom. See, we're attacking this monster. And there it goes. Combat in the game. Now learn to pick up item. I picked up the item. Man, okay, we need to hunt another one. Then pick up the item. Okay, hunting the monster. And then picking up the items. What is this? Small horn. Ending tutorial. Start beginner's quest. I'm really liking this. Because the last Tantra server I played, there's no such thing as this. They drop you somewhere and then do whatever you want. There's quest though. But it's optional. Do you wish to carry out the mission for newbies? Okay, I wanna see this. And what happened there? Uh, I wanna carry it out. But where's the quest tracker? There is no quest tracker. Inventory character info quest there it goes according to this collect and sell item to the npc find blacksmith vartan who's located at the southwest corner of mandara village uh here's mandara village yeah wow i, I guess i'm just gonna use what i remember i think this is the blacksmith i could be wrong but i'm pretty sure this is it let's just go there man there's nobody here Ah, there's people playing. I heard there's nobody. Look at this. Man, the name of this guy. <laughs> what? I think that's the guild name. This guy's 
It's 2022. You can't do that. <laughs> okay, let's look for the blacksmith. And there goes the blacksmith. He kind of looks like a hobo old man. <laughs> Talk to him. Finish conversation. Uh, I think I need to sell stuff. This thing? How do we sell this? Sell? Okay, we sold something. Conversation? Let's see if it's gonna finish our quest. Finish conversation. Okay, close this. I don't know what we need to do. Open up the quest. Oh, okay. Now he wants us to get three small horns from Basha Bombs. Let's go. Man, I'm lagging this. We have something to do. Because the first time I played this, I just roam around the map and do stuff I wanted to do. In a way, I like it that way. But sometimes when you're beginning in a game, you need a bit of a guide, you know, to show us the ropes. Okay, there goes the boobs. Man, the guild name of this, guys. Why is he red? Is he some kind of a PK player? If you PK me, I'm gonna PK you. Bruh, no, I'm gonna PK you. Come here, bruh. Bro, go ahead, show the PvP. Fight, 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 fight. Eh, you're all poses. You're not fighting. Get this basa bomb. Okay, we got that monster. What did we get? Oh, look at this. PvP, fight, fight. Fight, guys, fight. Fight. You son of a... You both look the same. Three small horns. Looks like this is gonna take a while. Is this a small horn? Loot it. Okay, I got a small horn. They're fighting, but they're only hitting one another one at a time. <laughs> okay, we got another small horn. Another one. Yeah, they're fighting. Look at this. Here's the Tantra PvP. Come on, guys, fight. Show me. Show me what it's all about. Man, your guild names. Can I attack you guys? Nope. They're not damaging each other. Look at this HP. Still full. Come on, guys. Do it. Okay, there he goes. Start the fight. Knock each other out. Okay, they stop. I'm gonna turn over the quest. Hobo man. Here's your quest. Conversation. Finish conversation. Close this. I just need to talk to him and that's it. I had three small horns, right? No, I only have two. What the what? Okay, I need to go back and get another one. Those two guys at the front gate, they bothered me. I was watching them. They're not really fighting. Okay, here's the skills. I think I can put some of this thing. Oh yeah, now we have one skill. Let's put it here. Let's try it out. Oh, look at this. Now they're fighting. Go fight, fight. Oh, and they stopped when I came here. What? Okay, there goes. Kill each other. Show me who's the best. They stopped again. They're just training. Let's look for the small horns. Let's try out the skills. Mantra. Try it out. Mantra. There it goes. The magic attack. And the wolf didn't drop a small horn. It's a bomb. Oh, give me a small horn, guys. One more. Come on, my small horn. There it goes. Get it. Okay, we got the small horn. Turn over the quest. Let's verify if we have three. Yep, we have three. Blacksmith. Vartan. Okay, there it goes. We're done with that quest. Close it. Now what? Go to Defense General Afvas, who is found near the south entrance of Vandara village. Just at the entrance. Okay, but the cannon is still an item in our inventory. He gave us something. Chori gloves. Okay, now we have gloves. Let's look for the general. I think this is the general. He's just standing there all day. General, give me a quest. For some reason, this game is running really well. The last time I played this, it was lower than 30 frames. It's probably because there's a lot more people on the last server I'm playing in. Okay, we're done with that quest. Close this. Check our new quest. Oh, he gave us Chori shoes. Now we need to go to the tradesman, Bovan, northwest corner of Mandara village. I think it's here. There are people playing the game. Look at this. There's a lot of them. Top end. I think I got buffed. Somebody buffed me? Man, the NPC should be just here. According to the instruction, it's northwest. Open up the map for at the northwest. Finding NPC. Tradesman. Man, it's not at the northwest. According to the minimap, he's at the center of Mandara village. Look at this. That instructions. Okay, but this place kind of looks cool. Look at this. There's some merchants over here. Greedy merchants. Mm -hmm. Tradesman. Give me another quest. Now he wants me to find a craftsman named Kirika, who is found at the southeast hill in Mandara village. And let's just open the mini map. 
And finding NPC and look for Kirika. Okay, Kirika is over here. Let's go there. Oh, look at this mount. It's kind of cool. What this? Oh, bruh. Don't run away. I was inspecting you. That's kind of a cool mount. Oh, there's more over here. We got some kind of a uh, Black Panther mount. And this one is a White Tiger mount. Okay, now what? Where's that NPC again? He's here. I think at the back. Ah, oh, there he goes. At the top of the hill. Yeah. Here goes Crapsman mm. Kirika. You don't look like a Crapsman. Okay, give me another quest. Okay, we need to repair an item. Repair defense. Okay, this thing. Repair impossible. What? After getting an item from Tradesman Bovan. Go to the Crapsman. I need to get an item from Bovan first. Or do I just need to repair something? Oh, okay, I need to get an item from the Tradesman. Okay, I got the item from the Tradesman. And now we can talk to Kirika to repair it. But before we do that, let's check out the cash shop. And look at this, guys. This is the cash shop. This is about it. Look at this. Buy premium item. When you click this, it's gonna deduct. It's gonna deduct some premium currency. Look at this. Reach. It's called Tani for some reason. Then here's buy premium item package. And I don't even know what this is. There's no description. Buy premium item. Look at this. Use special effect. Avatar store. <laughs> this is very simplistic. Because when they made this game, they had no plans for cash-ups and item malls. Those were the times where the developers are focused on making a good game. Not making a cash-up first, then making a game after that. <laughs> you get my point. Okay, and premium service usage. That's the cash-up. And let's talk to Kiriko. Mm. Finish conversation. Are we done with the quest? Now we need to get three low-quality horns by hunting more Vasa bombs. Okay, let's go outside. Hunt more wolves. What's my quest again? Low quality horns. Is that it? Low quality horns. Oh, let's check if we can use another skill. What's our level again? See? Oh, let's command character. We're now level 7. We can take the other skill. This one. Agni. I think that's Agni. <laughs> use it. Let's try it out. Agni skill. Yeah. Uh, it's a fire elemental attack. Yeah, it's Agni. But it's spelled as Ogni. Attack! Give me the small horns. We cannot tab in this game. When we tab, the UI disappears. Except the minimap. Which is kind of good if you want to take screenshots. Attack that wolf. Am I getting any small horn? Ooh, headband. Now we have a headband. Is it showing? No. Check our quest again. That's the first small horn. Give me more. Potions and money. Give me the quest item. I never like these kinds of quests. Wherein it's not guaranteed that you get the item when you hunt monsters. Sometimes it takes you 30 minutes to finish these kinds of quests. Ooh, what's that? Something on the ground. Check it out. Upgrade material. Okay. Let's try melee attacking. Our melee attack is weak, of course. We're a mage. Oh, come on, die, bruh. Okay, defeat them. Okay, we won. One more. The small horn isn't dropping. Eh, let's not loot. Let's keep hunting monsters till we get the small horn. One more small horn and we're done. Well, thankfully, we're super long range. We're super long range. I was trying to get close to the enemy. Turns out we can attack enemies from super far away. And there goes the small horn. Are we done? Got three. Let's turn over the quest. This game is really popular in the Philippines. Pretty much every cafe here has Tantra online. Way back. I don't know now. The cafes are kind of disappearing nowadays because of mobile devices. Most of the players are using mobile phones. It's just much more cheaper and convenient. Plus, most of us have phones. Do you guys have phones? <laughs> Crapsman mm. Kirika. Okay, is that it? What am I supposed to do here? I mean, low quality horns. No, this is small horns. Wow, this game. Low quality. By hunting Vasabom Cora. Ah! <laughs> we need to hunt the other monster. I think the one, the orange one. The lion looking monster. My bad, guys. My bad. It's my fault. I wasn't paying attention to the quest instruction. 
because it's kind of a wall of text. <laughs> I don't read as much. This is one of those MMORPGs that I just watched some of my classmates play it. Oh, okay, anyway, here's the monster. Let's hunt it down. Oh, it's kind of strong. Needs two hits before it goes down. Two cast of skills. Oh my. You can't even get near me, bro. We're super long range. Let's buy a weapon after this. Maybe a staff. Still not dropping any quest item. Come on, guys. How many do I need to hunt before you give me something? Okay, we got one low quality horn. Just one. I don't even remember picking that up. Is it auto loot? Oh, I stopped attacking because I don't have any mana. I should pick up the mana potions. Yeah. Even the normal ones. Let's use it. Oh, another one of those crafting items. I don't want to pick it up. Oh, let's level up the skills. My attacks are getting weaker. Now we have two low quality horns. Can we add stats? Oh yeah, we could. Let's add more mental. Because we're mental. <laughs> Max it out. Max out the mental. Because we're mental. <laughs> okay, check this girls. Now what? Mantra energy. Okay, this one. Put one of this thing. Okay, even this. Now we have two new skills. Let's test it out. Put some of this passive for fun. <laughs> Level 10 needed. Okay. Got that. Let's use the new skills we got. Lahari Mantra. Agni Gona. Let's try. Oh, oh. Lahari Mantra first. That's... Oh, it's an AOE attack. Nice. I'm liking it. How about... Guna. Let's try it out. Oh, it's a buff. I'm liking this fourth skill. Let's go, Lahari Mantra. It's a super AOE attack. Nice. And there goes our quest. I like that skill. Okay, did we pick it up? Yep. Let's turn over the quest. But first, I want to buy a weapon. Let's turn over the quest first and see if she's gonna sell us something. If not, we're gonna go to the blacksmith and buy a staff or something that will make our magic attack stronger. Or maybe armors. But do we have money? <laughs> That's the question. We don't... I think this is the money. Rupia. Man, I really like playing this now. Because it runs really well. My first experience playing this wasn't that great. Because the frame rate is very low. Mm. It's probably because, yeah, there's some more people playing in the last server I played in. This one has a few. Not that much, though. Okay, we're done with the quest. Oh, I need to give it to a different NPC. I need to give it to the priest Van... Vananta. Okay, but... Sell me something. Oh, but I can't buy anything here. I can buy a Chori armor. How about weapons? Sell me weapons. No, there's no weapons here. I'm not interested in all of those. I think I'm gonna get those for free. Because most of the quests here is giving away free equipments. Okay, let's look for the priest. Oh yeah, I remember that priest. He's Master Bhutan. We need to meet Master Bhutan at the top of the temple. Let's go. Okay, we're at the temple. It's very temple-y. <laughs> And there goes Master Bhutan. Look at this. Priest Bananta. Master Bhutan, here's your quest. Give low quality horn. Finish conversation. Now what? I need to return to Kirika? Man, there's a lot of back and forth in here. Is that really my quest? I need to return to Craftsman Kirika. Okay, close this. If I remember correctly, the first time I saw Tantra was on a magazine. Yeah, my, the dirty magazine of my brother. It was my brother, it's not mine. Believe me. Okay, there goes Craftsman Kirika. Oh yeah, we need to return to her. 
And now what? We need to return to the general again. It's a lot of back and forth. There goes the general. Give me another quest. Yes, I'll do it. Whatever that is. Job change. What? First job change. Reconfirm. Finish conversation. Conversation. Listen more. Listen more. Finish conversation. Vananta. Okay, we need to talk to Vananta. We see. Where is Vananta? It's Master Buten. I forgot. According to him, I need to go to Master Buten. Man, there's a lot of walking in this game. It wouldn't help if they offered a mount, a free mount for new players. It wouldn't hurt their bottom line. It's gonna make newer players more happy playing the game. Makes sense, right? But I don't know. It's just giving away a free mount. Cause look at this. We walk really slow. Okay, Master Buten. Change my job. Finish conversation. Uh, is that it? First job change. Now I need to hunt the following. Vashabom, Koras, Mekas, Kulapras, and Melekes, Koras. What the, these names? Okay, we need to hunt those things to be able to change our job, which is... I don't know if we can do it. We're gonna try hunting other monsters. Maybe look for the Meches and this Kulapras. Let's see if we can hunt it down. If not, then yeah. <laughs> Let's go. There's no quest tracker. This is gonna be troublesome. I hope I remember all of those monsters that I need to hunt. Now, where do we find the other monster? Let's AOE these guys. AOE! Boom! I'm liking that skill. Makes things easier. Hunting monsters easier. Okay, let's look for the other monsters. We're leveling up really fast, right? What's our level now? We're now level 10. Ah, there goes the mages. How about the Kulapras? Let's hunt a few of these things. See how it goes. Just three. And then let's look for the Kulapras. We're OP. It's probably here, the Kulapras. I have a feeling it's here. Because I remember this area over here if we go there. There's some kind of a temple there. There's no monster. Oh no, this is a different monster. It's orange. It's probably very strong. But... See how it goes. Let's fight it. Let's use a buff first. Ognigona. And then... What's the name of this skill again? Lahari Mantra. And defeat that guy. Defeat that guy. Defeat him before he gets to me. Uh-oh. I hope I don't... <laughs> we died. And that's Tantra Online from the start. I enjoyed the starting experience this time because I knew what to do. And I'm not super lost. Plus, I like the abilities of my character. It's exactly what I wanted. It's super AoE. Now, the quest line. Some of it are very easy to follow. To be honest, sometimes it's hard to track what you need to do. Because there's no quest tracker. But aside that, it's all fine. Now, the combat. It's classic tab targeting. One of the earliest ones. And it gets the job done. As for the graphics, it's getting retro. Certainly showing its age. And for the frame rates, it ran around 60, so it's fine. Overall, it's still playable. But I believe most of the people that's gonna look for this are the kids who grew up playing it. And if you're one of those kids, the details are on the screen. And if you like the video, hit the thumbs up, share, and then subscribe to be part of the Gaming Hardcore family. And as always, this is Gaming Hardcore. See you in the next one.